These ships show port calls at Ukraine's Black Sea ports in the days before Russia invaded the country. Here's how that compares to the days after the fighting broke out, six months after the war started under the Black Sea Grain Initiative, and then again this summer after Russia pulled out of the Black Sea Grain deal. They show how Russia has tried to choke Ukraine off financially, and Moscow has done this a number of ways, like by capturing some strategic port cities and bombing others with missiles. Russia has also destroyed infrastructure used to export grain and put warships in shipping corridors. Now, to keep Ukraine's economy afloat, Kiev and its allies are trying to export products this way, down the Danube River and through Romania's ports on the Black Sea. This route is slower and more expensive than using Ukraine's Black Sea ports, but it's considered to be safer. And that's because Romania, Bulgaria, and Turkey are all NATO members. Russia has threatened this new route, but the U.S. says it's considering all possible options, including military solutions, to protect ships that are traveling to these ports. 